Welcome to our comprehensive guide on the Windows subfile in IBM iRPGLE. In this video, we'll delve into the details of using the Windows subfile technique to manage and display multiple records within a defined window on the screen, rather than taking up the entire display area. Before we dive into the example, let's understand the declaration of the files. EMP master employee details file it declares the EMP master file, which is keyed and used for input operations only. EMP DSPF, employee details display. This line declares the EMP DSPF workstation file with a Windows subfile EMP SFL, controlled by RRN1 and uses the indicator data structure INDDS1. Then, defining the indicators and variables, this data structure defines various indicators used to control the window subfile operations. The variable RRN1 is used to manage the relative record numbers for the subfiles. Main processing loop. This loop continues until the exit indicator is set to off. It calls subroutines to clear, load, and display employee details. Clear employee details subroutine. This subroutine clears the window subfile by setting the clear indicator and writing the control record. WDSFLCLR equals on sets the indicator to clear the window subfile and write EMPCTL writes the control record to the window subfile. Load employee details subroutine. This subroutine loads employee details from the EMP master file into the window subfile. SETLL level. EMP master positions the file pointer at the beginning of the file. Read EMP master line reads the first record. The loop continues until the end of the file is reached. Do while not percent EOF. Inside the loop, employee details are assigned to window subfile fields. The relative record number is increment, and the subfile record is written. If RRN1 greater than 9999, Leave SR and diff these lines ensure that the window subfile does not exceed its maximum capacity. Display employee details subroutine. This subroutine displays the subfile. WDSFLCTL equals on and WDSFLDSB equals on. Set the indicators to display the window subfile and its control record. If RRN1 or 1, WDSFLDSB equals off and diff. Ensure that the window subfile is not displayed if it is empty. Right footer, right footer records. EXFMT EMPCTL displays the window subfile control record and allows user interaction. The loop, do while exit equals off, continues to display the detail record until the user exit. The EXFMT EMPCTL line displays the detail record and allows user interaction. If the exit indicator is set to on, the loop exits. In conclusion, the window subfile technique in IBM iRPGLE is essential for managing and displaying multiple records within a defined window on the screen. Thank you for watching our video tutorial on the window subfile in IBM iRPGLE by Programmers.io. We hope you found it informative and useful for your programming task. If you have any questions or would like to explore more RPGLE topics, feel free to leave a comment below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more RPGLE programming insight. Happy coding!